Yo guys, what's up? Welcome back. Today's workout, we have a Tabata Tuesday. You know what that means. Tabata always makes you hotter. The goal for today's workout is to blast fat. Why? Because we're working for short intervals of time, high intensity, or maybe some strict, slow strength. We're gonna blast calories, we're gonna burn fat, and we're gonna build muscle at the same time. So guys, join me in our warm up. Let's bring our feet between hip to shoulder width apart. Give me 10 regular air squats. You guys gonna count for me? Yeah. Awesome, here we go. Bring it up and down. Now remember, today's workout, if you've never done a Tabaza Tuesday before, it is 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off. We're gonna have two exercises. We're gonna alternate between those two exercises for a total of four minutes. Nine. Which is technically, ten. that was 10. Thank you guys so much. Butt kicks, bring that heel right up to your butt. Which is technically gonna be four rounds. Eight rounds of Tabata, four of each exercise. We've got two exercises for section A, we'll rest for 60. Then we've got B, rest for 60 and C. We're gonna hit two rounds total and we're gonna have a lot of fun while we do it. What do you guys think? Let's go. Oh, yeah. Okay, thank Come you. On. Let me talk about our workout and our moves. Everyone bring your feet about shoulder width apart. Now we've seen this before. We're gonna differentiate between the hinge and the squat. So first of all, we're gonna soften our knees. We're gonna leave our feet in the base of our squat position. From here, I'm gonna karate chop my hips backwards, making sure that at the base of my rep, my knees are stacked on top of my ankles. Now I can feel my posterior chain, my ass, my hamstrings, everything is nice and tight. From here, I want you to imagine trying to separate the ground with your heels on your way up and driving through your heels. Squeezing that butt right at the top. Now go again. Good, let's go for five. Pulling those shoulders back, four. Good, three. We've got two and one. Now I wanna go one hinge, one squat. Ready, here we go. One hinge, feet stay the same, one squat. One hinge, one squat. So check out the difference, hips go back and hips go down. So for section A of our workout today, we have Russian kettlebell swings using that explosive hip hinge. From here, thrusting our hips forward, kettlebell will come up to eye level. Then our second exercise is gonna be kettlebell sumo squats. So think of a sumo wrestler, wider than a regular squat position, we're gonna pulse up and down. 20 seconds, keeping the muscles under stress. That's all you guys need to know from now. Let's go ahead and warm up a little bit more. Leave your feet right underneath your hips. Come down, try and touch the floor. Nice work, round that back out, stretch out those hamstrings, a posterior chain. Now walk your hands out in front of you. Leave your heels locked right into the ground. And now one at a time, tread them. Good, getting your Achilles, your calf muscle, your hamstrings right up into that gluteal fold. Awesome. Now push both of your heels down. Send your head between your shoulders. Send the weight into the back of your legs. Arch that lower back and breathe. Good, now from here, I want you to find your push-up plank position. Keeping your shoulders stacked right over the top of your wrists. Bring that right foot on the outside of your right hand. Good, lizard lunge, chest up high, hips down nice and low. Breathe, you can rock it back and forth if you'd like. Anything you gotta do to open up your hips. Maybe you come onto the outer blade of your foot, push it out depending on your mobility. Now, I just wanna touch on a couple things. Leave your left hand down, guys. Look up at your right fingertips. Now, we've mentioned this before, I'm gonna mention it again. Beginner, intermediate, advanced doesn't necessarily need to mean that you're at the beginning of your fitness game. I want you to remember that this kind of workout, combining strength and cardio together, is an entire different game. Switch sides, find that downward dog position again, tread your heels. So wherever you're at, I want you to stick with that form. If you're a beginner, but it's too easy, level up and come to intermediate, left foot forward. However, if you're a beginner, and you're trying to go intermediate and your form is compromised, you're not getting any gains that way. Take a step back, build the foundations so that we can level up in the future. Right hand down, left hand up. Good. Breathe. Take a deep breath in, twist. Awesome. Now bring that hand back to the floor. Feet on the floor, walk it in, come up one vertebrae at a time. Give me 10 jumping jacks, let's go. Good. Breathe it out. My boys are quiet. Oh, maybe, you know, I'm gonna leave them on the spot. Maybe they've got some inspirational, motivating words for you guys to get through the workout today. I'm gonna give them a little while. They'll get through section A. I'll ask them in the rest of section B. So guys, let's get that brain thinking, those Good. wheels turning, and these guys are gonna be spitting knowledge just at you all of a sudden. So, you guys ready? Let's get oh, it. Yeah. All right, so here's the deal. You need two light dumbbells, one heavier kettlebell. Grab your kettlebell. All you need to know for now is we have Russian swings, and sumo pulse squats. We're gonna alternate between those two 
for four minutes. What you guys thinking? Let's get it, baby. All right, you guys at home, you ready? Let's get that clock started. We've got five, we've got four, three, two, and one. Let's go. Hit it. In, up. Good. Breathe. Exhale at the top. Exhaling on that effort. Inhale as you receive. Good, we've got 10 seconds. Breathe. Driving through those heels. Power. Squeeze your quads. Three, two, and one. Set it down and relax. Great job. Now I'm gonna join Tanner over here for a beginners. Three, two, one. Sumo pulse squats. Think about a sumo wrestler. How do we make this easier? We're gonna slow your pace down and we're gonna stop at the top and take a breath. Come down, bring it up, take a breath. We've got 10 seconds, guys. Paolo over here. More advanced, he is not letting that kettlebell touch the floor. His knees are never locking out. Three, two, one, rest. Knees are never locking out. When we keep our knees soft, our muscles are under tension. As soon as we lock out, skeletal system takes over. Second round, three, two, one. Russian swings. Hup. Power. Good. Generating momentum from our hips all the way through our body to the end of that bell. Halfway. Let's go. Come on. We've got five. We've got four. Three, two, one. Set it down with control. You pick your weights up and you put them down with as much control as you do when you lift. Three, two, one. Hit it. Breathe. So guys, I'm gonna challenge Tanner here. A lot of people think, oh, if I touch my kettlebell on the floor, I'm working harder. No, you're not. Whether you think about it or not, there is some disengagement. I want there to be enough space so he doesn't crush my hands. Good. We've got seven seconds. Breathe. Again, retracting those shoulder blades back. Three, two, one, rest. Making sure our chest is nice and proud. Don't let it hunch over at any point. Shoulders pinned back. You guys ready? Yeah. Three, two, one. Let's go. Come on. In, up. Power. Aggression. Squeeze your ass. Squeeze your quads. Come on, at the top of your rep. Your shoulders, hips and ankles should be in a straight line. We're halfway already. You can do anything for 20 seconds. Come on, five, four, three, two, and one. Put it down, shake it off. You guys ready? Oh yeah. All right, here we go. Sumo pole squats in three, two, one. Pick it up, here we go. Down and up. Inhale, exhale. Notice my grip. If I hold here, my range is decreased. If I hold here, I give myself a couple extra inches. We've got 10 seconds. Breathe, pulsing it up and down. Five, four, three, two, and one. Great job, put it down, shake it off. We've got one more of each, what you guys think? Burn it. Here we go, five, four, set up. Three, two, one. In, up. Shh. Shh. You hear Paolo's breathing? Tana, where you at? Exhale on the effort. Exhale that pain. Five, you've got four, come on. Three, two, and relax. Great job. Sumo pulse squats, let's go. No locking out the knees, no kettlebells on the floor. Three, two, one, let's hit it. Here we go. Pull the shoulder blades back, pulsing. Straight up. Straight down, taking the same amount of time on the way up as we are on the way down. Don't drop, control. Control the negative. Here we go, five, four, driving up through those heels, three, two, one. Awesome job. Woo. Take a moment, you've got one minute to rest. Don't worry, I'm coming to get your upper body. I know your legs are smoked. Your two next exercises. We have a lateral raise and an overhead press. You're gonna grab two weights that weigh the same. 20 seconds, feet underneath your hips, soft athletic position. Put your shoulders in your back pocket, keep your ribs tucked in. It's like your ribs and your hips are fighting each other. Squeeze your hips forward, press your ribs down. Keep your core nice and tight. Big breath, exhale. Soft elbow, palms are facing down. Second exercise, nice wide grip. Elbow stacked underneath your wrist, you're gonna press up. But I'm not gonna come to here. I'm not gonna allow my skeletal system to take over. I can stay here all day. Can I stay here all day? No. Time under tension, creating as much stress as possible. 
You guys have got 10 seconds. Let's go. We're going to be here for four minutes, so you may as well get the most of it. Pick it up. Three, two, one. Here we go. Exhale. Control. Really common mistake is this. If your body is jolting, don't do that. Put your weights down, decrease your load, and take control. Notice over here, we've got 10 seconds. Tanner is going one arm at a time, but just because he's going one doesn't mean his body can get off. Three, two, one, relax. Keeping that core engaged, stabilizing so that we're not going all over the place. Overhead press in five, four, three, two, one. Same thing here. Single arm if you need it. If this is too easy for you, go double arm. Single, single, double until your form is compromised. Keep your ribs tucked. You've got 10 seconds. Powers over here. If I was to punch him in the core, which I wouldn't because I love the man. Do it. There you go. Oh, that felt good. Three, two, one, rest. All right, we're going to go again. If you're advanced and you want a little bit more here, join me. Are you ready? Here we go. Yeah. Exhale. Shh. Hold him up. And with control, you're going to come down. But notice I am not coming all the way down. I'm disengaged. I'm trying to make this the hardest 20 seconds I got. You've got to be here for 20 seconds. You may as well make the most of it. Come on. You've got seven seconds. All about those gains, baby. Come on. Five, four, three, two, and one. Great job. Now, you're going to notice I said do not drop your weights. Keeping that body under stress, it doesn't mean we need to stay active. Palms up. Go. Shh. Almost like a Y press. At the top of my rep, my hands are wider than my shoulders. Bring it back down. Keeping those elbows stacked. Breathe. Keeping that rib tucked. Core is engaged, hips are behind me. We've got less than 10 now. Come on. As hard as you can. Mind to muscle. Three, two, one. Relax. Don't let him touch the floor. Are you ready, Tana? Ready. Let's go again. Five, four, three, two, one. Shoulder shrug backwards. Here we go. We're all at different levels here, but we're in it together. And we're not going to quit, because guess what? You can do anything for 15 more seconds. 20 total. Don't jolt it. If I was to say freeze, you should be able to control every inch of your movement. Five, four, three, two, and one. Yeah, that's what's up. How you doing, babe? I'm good. All right, here you go. You ready? We're going to stick together. Big chest, big proud chest, ribs tucked. Go! Press. Bring it back down like you're trying to pull those weights down. Push them up and pull them back down. Breathe. Slow and controlled. This one is deceiving. You've got 10 seconds. Don't you dare quit. Uh, Come on. Seven seconds, baby. Let's go. Six. Breathe. Five. Four. Three. Two. Uh, and one. Great job. Fuck. You got... Oh, fuck is right. Yes, you heard it here. I think that's the first one we dropped. Three. Two. One. Let's go. Squeeze. I want you to make this as hard as you can. Engage. Don't just move from A to B. Feel it. I want you to get the most out of the time that you're in here. Let's go. Ten seconds now. Uh, oh, shit. Uh, Seven seconds. Come on. Six. Five. Don't you dare quit. Three, two, uh, and one. Oh, yeah. Things are getting spicy around here. How you doing? Burning. Here we go, baby. Three, two, one. Big proud chest. Press. Inhale over your nose on the way down. Shh. Exhale the pain on the way up. Pull that weight down. Press it back up. Pull that weight down. Let's go. Halfway already. There we go. Breathe. Let's go. Keep those ribs tucked. If your form is compromised, uh, put that shit down. Three, no. two, one. Ho! Oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> you can let go now. You can let go. If you are beginning, you do not have to use a dumbbell for the next exercise. We have two. V-ups and a zombie sit-up. So what's a V-up, you ask me? Maybe from FYR 1.0, things get a little challenging here in the V-up. It is core strength, but if we don't have enough uh, lower back strength, maybe we need to regress a little and go single leg. So a full version is a hollow body position. Bring your hands up to meet your feet. Initiating the movement with my hands. If I initiate with my legs, there's no way my back's getting off the floor. So hands come up, lift your legs. If that's too much, one leg at a time. You want a challenge, don't let your heels touch the floor for the full 20 seconds. Zombie sit up, one dumbbell if you want it. Arms extended, exhale, and reach. You guys ready? Yeah. You've got 10 seconds, I'm gonna start with Tana. Take a nice deep breath in. Remember, core work, all about the breathing. Three, two, one. Let's go, Tana. 
good. So I'm going to help Tanner out here. See how his arms and his legs are coming off at the same time? I'm going to hold his legs back. Check it out. Bring your upper body up. All the way, all the way, all the way. As soon as you feel that, then bring your leg. Feel it. Great job. Oh, where's that dumbbell, huh? What dumbbell? Looks like I could give you a little gift right here. Happy birthday, mother liquor. Let's go. Exhale. Breathe. Bring it back. Good. Exhale. Bring it back. Good. Hey, guess what, guys? You were working through your rest. Keep going. You've got 15 more seconds here. Exhale and reach. Straight up. The name of the game is straight up. Your body's going to want you to come forward. We're not going to go forward. Wrist, elbow, shoulder stacked right on top of each other. You've got five, four, three, two, one. Rest. Great job. I'm going to join you on this one. And I promise I'll give you your rest this time. My bad. Here we go. We've got V-ups in five, four, three, two, one. Squeeze your ass. Squeeze your quads. Hollow body position. Upper body comes up to meet your toes at the top. If you feel anything in your lower back, chances are we don't quite have that core or back strength yet. Come 10 on. seconds, let's go. Exhale, Shh. inhale, Shh. good. Three, two, and one, great job. Now, zombie sit-ups, first 10 seconds, you guys are on your own. Last 10 seconds, I'm gonna count you down from 10. Every number needs to be a rep, with or without a weight, go. Shh. On my way down, it's like I'm trying to hit one vertebrae at a time. But when I get to the bottom, I'm not relaxing. I'm coming straight back up. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Here ya. Very nice, guys. You ready to go again? Take a deep breath. You've got 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. If you want the challenge, do not let your heels touch the floor for the next 20 seconds. Even if you're going single leg, you can also add that challenge if you want it. You've got 10 seconds, squeeze. Squeeze your quads, squeeze your ass, keep your legs straight. If you're going double leg, make sure they're both moving at the same time. Three, two, one, time. 10 seconds, you've got those zombie sit-ups. Remember, first 10 seconds, you're on your own. Last 10, join me. Three, two, one, go. Exhale on that effort, inhale on the way back down. Breathe. Let's get ready, guys. Come with me. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Woo. Rest. Hey, now. One more of each. Bring it, people. Here we go. 3, 2, 1. Go. 20 seconds, and remember, what can you do, Tanner? Heels off the ground. I thought he was really gonna get that one. You can do anything for 20 seconds. Let's go. Come on, breathe. Five, four, three, two, and one. Great job. Last zombie sit-ups, I'm gonna count you up. One to 10, 10 to one. You guys ready? Yeah. yeah. Here we go, get ready. Three, two, one. Hit it. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, reach. Eight, nine, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Oh boy, that was spicy. Here's the deal. We got through round one. How are you guys feeling? I'm good. Burn. They're so quiet. Tana, you've got 50 seconds to inspire the shit out of these people. Let's go. If you can control your mind, you can control your life. That is fucking true, <laughs> let me tell you that. Paolo, what you got? It's about what we're doing here, Anna. What about what we're doing here? Slow is strong, and strong can always be fast. You hear that? Once you master the slow movement, you can go fast all day. You hear that? And listen, to Pat Tana's point, since we saw each other since the FYR 1.0, I just biked and ran 828.6 miles around the entire country of Iceland. There is no way in hell that I could physically do that. But I convinced my mind I could, so guess what? My body followed and I did that shit. Okay, you guys have got this. It all starts right here. Guess what? Five seconds till we start round two. Get that kettlebell. Russian swings in three, two, one. Hit it. Shh. Squeeze. You're gonna have integrity in our form. It's what you do while no one's looking that matters the most. I can see you. 
Keep that shit tight. Let's go. Seven, six, bring it. You have three. Come on, two, one. Put it down, control. Now, when I see people put their weights down like this, nay, nay, sister or brother, put that down carefully. Your back matters. Three, two, one, let's go. Close those eyes. Feel onto that feeling. Hold on to it and let go in 10 seconds. Pull those shoulders back. Breathe. You have seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Oh yeah. We're switching from our posterior to our quads. You guys feel that? Oh yeah. Three, two, one. Hit it. In, up, squeeze. Good. Breathe. You have 12 seconds. Keep those lats engaged. Keep that core engaged. Squeeze your quads. Squeeze your ass. Three, two, time. Put it down with control. Shake it off. Now, remember those hikes? You're going to put it down the same way. Three, two, one. Let's go. Big proud chest. Pull those shoulder blades back. Keep that core engaged. Remember, keeping those knees soft. If you're a beginner and you need a rest at the top, take it. If you're not, keep the muscles under stress. It's like you're pumping them out. Keep going. Make it as hard as you can to get the most gains. Rest. Oh, yeah. All right. Five seconds, get ready. Four, three, two, one. Hit it. Breathe, stay in it, stay focused. Come on, halfway. This is it. Well into our second round now. Two rounds and we're done. Three, two, one. Relax, good, control. Shake it off, take a deep breath in. Exhale all the way. Three, two, one. Go, sumo wrestler. Keeping those knees stacked. You got a line from your ankles to your knees to your hips. And no point is that nine caving in. Big proud chest. Keep it tight. Three. You got seven seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Nice one. Solid. How you doing, Papi Brazil? I'm, good. I'm still feeling my shoulders. Hey. I don't know about you guys. I'm feeling it. You guys ready? That be gun. Three, two, one. Hit it. Last set. Make it a strong set, guys. Come on. We got 12 seconds, Tanner. Where you at? Hurting. Ha! We got less than 10 now. Breathe. Rely on that form, especially when you're under fatigue. Three, two, one. Time. Oh, boy. One more pulse squat. Shake it off. Get ready. Get wide. Three, two, one. Hit it. Here we go. Big proud chest. Inhale. Ha! Stay in it. Exhale that pain. Let go of that shit. Anything that annoys you, you think about it right now, right here. Leave it in the gym. Five, four, three, two, one. Awesome job. You got one minute to chill. Get this upper body ready. What do you guys think? Let's go. Ooh. This is the hardest one. Yes, it is. B. And let me tell you, I mean what I said. I know I had 10 seconds to talk about it, but I'm not a runner, I'm not a cyclist, but I got a strong mind and I have goals to hit. And I know you feel the same. Set those goals, do whatever you got to do to get prepared for that goal, and then you give it your best. And if you know that you've prepared for your goal, the only thing holding you back is this. And if it doesn't happen the first time, you didn't fail, you didn't lose, you exposed the hole in your game, which to me is the best thing you could do. So you can go back to the gym, patch that shit up, go again and make sure you hit that goal. That make sense? Yeah, what was the hardest part of Iceland, Hannah, for you? The hardest part of Iceland was starting. Every day it was the hardest part. But don't worry about that, pick up those dumbbells. Here we go. Three, two, one. Hit it, hold it up. If you want it, come get it. For real. The hardest part was starting. Every day when my body Literally, he was telling me a thousand reasons to not move. I was in so much pain. I'm convinced you can only get to a certain point of pain, and that's it. Three, two, and 
won. But what I did do is give myself a reason. It was a far better reason than myself. I didn't do those miles for me. Three, two, one. I did those miles for a reason far greater than me. But for other people that didn't have a voice. I was there through this incredible platform that I've been able to build through social media. We did some pretty powerful things together. And I know you feel the same way about us. In here, together we're stronger. Three, two, one. And look, I just distracted you, which is a great example of your mind taking over the physical. Before you know it, it's over. You guys ready? Come on. Here we go. Up. Inhale. Exhale. When we do any kind of raises, make sure your shoulders aren't creeping up. Take a big circle backwards, press them down at the same time. We don't want our traps getting involved. We want to hit those deltoids, those lats. Fight it on the way down. Four, you have three, two, and one. Great job. Remember, we're not putting them down. Keeping those muscles under stress, forearms attacks, upper body has never relaxed. Three, two, one. We're pressing. Good, soft elbows at the top, pressing out rather than here. I can stay here all day, baby. That's not what we're trying to do. We're trying to get gains. Muscle growth, fat blasting. Don't waste your time. We got this. We've got six, five, let's go. Four, three, two, and one. Hi, yeah. How you doing? Burning. That's what I like to hear. If it's burning, it's working. Three, two, one, go. Shh. Now, when it burns, most people quit. But it's when it burns is when it matters the most. Hold on. Ask yourself uh. to do one more rep when your mind tells you to quit. I guarantee you can carry one more after that, one more after that, four, three, two, one. Hi, yeah! Hoi, 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 hoi! Fire. How you doing? Fire, Fire is right, baby! Two, hoi, oh, go! Three. Exhale. Shh. Inhale. Shh. Exhale the pain, man. It's over soon. You got 10 seconds, breathe. Eight seconds, stay in it. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Oh boy. Uh, let it out, let it out. Five seconds, guys. Four, three, two, one, go. Shh. Inhale, exhale. Wait, am I doing the right thing? Yes, thank goodness for these guys. My mind just got lost. We got go. 10 seconds, breathe. Nine. Eight, hold on. Last one. Five, four, three, two, ho. Oh. Shit, it's not real. I don't know about you guys, but I'm like seeing stars right now. Are you ready? Five, four, three, two, one. Just 20 seconds. Let's go. Ha. Breathe. Out and wide. Tell yourself you can and you will. Get that negative shit out of your head. Let's go. Come on. Uh, don't quit. It's a choice. Make the right one. Seven, six, six, five, four, three, two, one. Ooh, Shit, now you can put him down. 100% put him down. Ooh. Shake it off. Give yourself a chest bump. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Bring it in. My upper body is screaming. I know yours is too. Don't worry. We went from our legs to our upper body. Now we're going to get that core. This is so important. Once you've got a strong core, everything else will be better too. Trust me. So again, we've got our V-ups with our zombie sit-up. You've got 30 seconds, come down. Take a seat, get comfortable. Take a sip of water, wipe your sweat. Shit's about to get real in 20 seconds. Now, like we said before, think about breathing on your core. Every time you exhale, it helps you contract. You know those abs that always stick out? You can be really strong, but if you don't engage and contract your core at the same time, they're gonna form all in the wrong places, all right? You guys ready? Good. We got five seconds, boys. Four, three, two, one. Here we go. Hey, who wants a challenge? If you're advanced, come with me. Power up, control the way down. Here we go. Squeeze, 10 seconds. Yeah. Ah. Three, two, one. Oh man. Going well. On camera, it may look like it's easier, but trust me, slow is hard. You guys ready? Three, two, one. Exhale, reach. 
Like I said before, one vertebrae at a time on the way down. Don't just drop. On the way down is where we stay in control. Control that negative. We're gonna get stronger. Less than 10 now. Come on. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Great job. Huh. How are you guys doing? Hurting. Where are you going, Pappy? He forgot his up. Hey, uh, I'm watching him. Three, two, one, go. Up. Control. Ah, control. That's right, we've got less than 10 now. Five seconds, hold on. Four, three, two. Time. Oh boy. Ready for that dumbbell sit up? I dare everyone to reach one inch higher. Three, two, one, go. Higher. Control. High. Control. Remember, it's actually going to help you if you come forward. We're trying to keep the weight stacked on top of a wrist, elbow, and shoulder. Straight up. It's a micro movement. Don't try and sit up all the way. Contracting those upper abs. Three, two, and one. Great job. We're halfway already, people. What you thinking? How are you feeling? I'm alive. I can't hear him. I want to hear your oohs, your ahs, your screams. Three, two, one, go. Control. Control. Ah. Ah. Halfway. Oh. I'm going to hammer him out. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. one. All right, here we go. Let's hit it again. Let's go. Five seconds, take Get a deep team. breath. Four, three, two, one, go. Shh. 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 There you are. Are you challenging me, Paolo? Hi, let's go. Let's go, come on. Reach. You guys halfway. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Hiya. Breathe. Okay. You have one more of each. Guys, I can't hear you. Gotta finish. Bring that A game. I'm Three, fucking here. Two, one, go. Last one. I want you guys to give me as many reps as you can. Hit it. Ten seconds. Go. Come on. Seven. Five. Four. Three. Two. Ah. Uh, One. Okay. Oh boy. We're okay. We're all right. Okay. Everything's okay here. You guys ready? Finish. One to ten, ten to one. Three, two, one, go! One, two, three, go! Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. One. Ay, ay, ay. It's all right. Get up. Everyone get up. We're okay. We always finish strong. We're okay. No matter how you feel. Hey! That was incredible. You at home, give me one of these. Ooh, nice work. Core got lit. Great full body workout. Upper body, lower body, core. Great balance. We shed a shit ton of calories. We built some muscle and we definitely had a good time while we do it. Thank you guys so much for being here. We'll see you soon.